Hi everyone, this is Mariana, trainer and technical documentation developer at In-House Solutions. I'm here with Mastercam Quick Tip of the Day. In this video, I'm going to demonstrate how to convert a 3-axis toolpath to a 5-axis toolpath using the holder collision checking option, tilt to avoid gouge. Machining deep pockets using a 5-axis toolpath instead of a 3-axis toolpath allows you to use a shorter tool. Note that this function only supports ball and mills. In my example, I'm finishing the walls of deep pockets using a 3D high-speed water line and a 3 8 uh, ball and mill. Without the collision checking enabled and with a tool projection of two inches, the holder is gouging the part. To fix the problem, in the holder page, I'm going to enable collision checking and tilt to avoid gouge. I'm going to change the maximum tilt angle to 10 degrees. I will give also a shank clearance of 50 tau and I enable clearance on holder bottom. Notice how the tool starts to tilt when it reaches the area where the holder can gouge the part. With a proper tilt angle, I had to change mine to 20 degrees, the tool can reach the bottom of the walls without gouging into the part. This concludes the quick tip of the day. Thank you for watching.